Hello. There's no war. And today we're doing a um, tier list of uh, God of War 2018's, you know, all the characters. You know, I know you must be wondering, like, Night War, why is this, why is this like part one? Because, you know, this this going to be like a two-parter. The first part right here is going to be all the all like the main characters and the second part is gonna be all like the enemies in the game so yeah so yeah that's gonna be two part for today and tuesday you know you know right before ragnarok comes out so yeah so yeah like, uh, that's what we gotta do in today's video and um and very um disclaimer um you know this based on my opinion of you know why i think about the characters and how I'm gonna rate these characters based on like their personalities, their motivations, you know, and you know how I like them through like throughout the story, you know, from like beginning to end. So yeah, you know, some might surprise you, some might might be a bit obvious, but still, it should be fun for the both of us. So yeah, so yeah, so like leaving, so leaving the comments down below, you know, how will you put these characters? You know, our opinion might be a little bit different but yeah that's what makes it fun so yeah so so yeah without further ado let's get into the to the tier list video whatever you want to name it so yeah let's get into it okay okay who should we start first oh yeah let's start with um who was his name charlie i think that was trade's saying name was charlie you know on um, foot you know, uh, Freya's, you know, um, housemate. Ooh, what were you calling? Um, so what should I put you? Oh, he looks neat. You know, I bet he's, like, pretty cool if you can, like, talk to him. He can, like, talk bad, but... You know, Sasha, man, he really doesn't do anything for the story. Um... Man... You know what? Uh, I'll put him at D. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't cover with that. Yeah, I'll put him at D. He just we really don't do anything for the story. He just I don't know. Just you know, he just there. You know, just for Freya to like live in, live inside him. I, I don't know. So yeah, I think that's my opinion of Charlie. Sorry, Charlie. I uh, hope it'd be more useful in Ragnarok, but yeah, you look you look cool, but yeah, yeah. This is this is it for him. Okay, so yeah, who I want to do now? now. You know what? Let's do let's do Faye, Faye, Faye. You know, Kratos' wife and Atreus' mother. I feel like with like Frey, she should be. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Just the way that everybody like talks about her, you know, like Kratos, Atreus, you know, Sindri, you know, you know, but we don't talk about her that much. Hmm, which I noticed, you know, why I like we play through it, which yeah, that's gonna be coming t soon, you know, in you know in the day. So yeah, I did pray where everybody talks about her. She used to be like, probably like an A, hmm? like an A or maybe like a B, but uh, I think my point with Freddy is just like, uh, I don't know, it, like I don't know, we really don't see her, you know, we are, the only image that we get her is just, you know, it's like at the end with, you know, with like the mural hmm? of like, you know, her like staying up to like, to like a people, to like the giants. Hmm? Yeah, I don't know. Man, this is tough. Hey, where wish what where I, where should I put you? Man, I don't know. Hmm. You know what? I didn't feel comfortable putting her at. 
Uh, well, I didn't go put it at C. Uh, I, just because we don't know, I don't know. We we don't know like too much about her, you know. I wish we could like maybe like hear her voice a little bit. Maybe got like a little flashback with her and Kratos. Like I don't know. Just I know that would mess up the story of like of like you know God of War twenty eighteen. But I don't know. I I we really do feel like to me like you know. <laughs> by like the A, you know, by like A by target to it seems to be at like probably like an A, but but since we don't get too much about her, you know what what her character was like, you know she she's a C, you know obviously she, she's not a D because uh, she does do some stuff, you know some little stuff, you know speaking out in like the story of like. Being like Kratos and Atreus, you know, to the, you know, to the giants, you know, to reveal that, you know, that she is a giant, you know, that's Atreus is a giant. So, so yeah, so that's had a little bit of significance to it. Okay, to the next one, uh, Manny. I think we first met Manny. I don't know. Oh, Manny, to me, I don't know. It was just, like, based on looks. He'd probably be, like, an A. But I think, like, the problem with him is just, like, we really don't know too much about him. You yeah, actually do know that he wants to, you know, we actually do know about him that he's, like, a bit of it. I like a, you know, he's like to, you know, he likes to, like, to, he likes to show off, you know, he's like to, to show people that, like, he's strong, that he's, you know, he can, like, take charge, you know, want to, want to, like, show his dad, you know, door that he can, like, probably, like, do stuff. That he's, like, the worthy son of, like, you know, of, like, the door family or something. Who knows? But, yeah, besides from, like, dad, we really don't know too much about him. Like, what he wants, what he need, you know, does he... Have like his own family of kids, who knows? So yeah, I didn't really put him at C. I think that's right because you know we really don't know too much about him. We know we get like a little bit about him here and there, but mm, yeah, I didn't come with putting me at like a C. I was a good him higher. You know his voice actor is like pretty good. He's pretty fucking intimidating. I don't get him that. Eh? Yeah. Uh, me, me, and him go to and to him now, man. Man, man, he was the store me. Mm-hmm. So yeah, so yeah, I didn't go put man him at a C with, with you know with her. Now Moody, but Moody, I do even know a little bit more about him than like him. No, 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 no. He's not a. Eh? <laughs> oh, he, he's not that special, eh? Uh, not Moody. Moody, I think we really know a little bit more about. You know, he's like the less favorite of like the sons. You know, we actually know that he's not like the most popular like God. He, he's like those that is, you know, like people like look down on him like like he's like the weakest. You know, Manny get on the test and Moody doesn't get that much attention. Like, even at, like, the end of his life, basically, you know, he got beat up for not being strong enough. You know, Thor, like, pretty much beat the shit out of him for not, for not doing enough, for not being a better guy. So, so yeah, I think that, I think that got to work a little bit more points for me. He still has C, but, because, like, I don't know, we really don't know too much about him besides, like, him being, like, the less favorite son. So, yeah. yeah. Besides from that, yeah, we really don't know too much about, like, Moody either. But he's a little bit better than his brother Manny, but not by that much. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I did that see rank so far. I really do feel like the characters that they got right so far, like, I don't know, he's almost at, like, 
Like he's almost there, but not quite, man. Like if we if we just had on I don't know, if we had like probably like more scenes with him, I don't know, maybe like a costume with like Manny and like Terry's father, like he's like father. You know, he killed like you know, man like Manny. Like what should you do now, dude? Like what the fuck you doing? Like you, you let him kill your brother, you re- like like you weak some you like hit him with like the hammer. You better go back out there. You better go fight Chris. Like, I don't know. I don't know. If we had like more scenes like that, he probably would be, probably, would probably be a B to me, but, mm, I don't know, he's just, ah, oh, man. I wish I could put a little bit more higher, but, mm, man. Okay, on to the next character. You know what? Let's do Mamir. Mamir to me, we first met him, he was like a B, but uh, I don't know. As his story like continued, yeah, let's talk about Mamir for a minute. Mamir, the, the smartest man alive. Like, I really do like Mamir. I think Mamir is like a really good character. He's funny, he's smart, he. We just get like very good advice to like Kratos and Atreus. Like, I don't know, you just like you just have like way of speaking, I don't know. Maybe just like the old tongue, you know, like like all the old language, you know, from like the middle days. I don't know. It's just some of them just make it just interesting. Uh in stories too, I don't know. If you like ride on like the boat with him, it's in like a very interesting story about like about like Freya's past, about like about like Odin, about Thor, about like the other gods that he met in his life. So, so yeah, then I'm gonna put him like at like an A. I think like the only reason he's not at at like war. Yeah, I don't know. I think it sounds from like you know getting from my like information, you know about like a god or two here and there. But maybe we doesn't do much. I don't know. Just like with Charlie, but he's better than Charlie. He's like a way better person than Charlie. Uh, I wish Mimir can like I don't know. Maybe like oh, uh, it would be like kind of cool if like Mimir like be like be like he'd be like brother. He was like what? He just like he like he like he like pull my hair off for a minute. He was like what? Mimir like pull my hair off, brother. He just like. I don't know, maybe like doing like the Mad and Mooney fight, he like he he like dumb me out and he just like bite the fucking nose off and just like <laughs> I don't know. I uh, need that be like please <laughs> like that'd be like a pretty cool move, just like Mamir throwing head at the way, I don't know. Just come with like the name in the comments down below, but but yeah, I don't know. I need that be like kinda sick. I need that that puts it to the edge of like him being like an S. So, so yeah, let's move on to like the next character, <sighs> the World Serpent. Um, what is something to me? Okay, let's talk about his character, like his character. Yeah, the World Serpent is cool. Like he's nice, you know. You know, first off, he didn't eat us, so. So yeah, I think that's like a plus. So yeah, so so yeah, I don't know he's both from C. You know, and like the conversation with like he had like with Mir is, you know, it's pretty good too. And also plus he did help us out in the end. You know, you know, when when like a friend, you know, almost. I do see he was trying to like what like freeze us. I think. So, so, I need to me. I don't know. I'm trying to sound. Do I want to put him in like A or B? Oh, he's definitely not war. So, uh, he's just not up there yet. Maybe in Ragnarok, but, mm, but what do I do for now? Um,. Man, very difficult. Hmm. Wait, let me think. Let me think. 
Yeah, like I said, yeah, he's definitely not C. So yeah, I think he's a B. Yeah, I think he's like he's like pretty solid. You know, he's not he's not great, but he's not terrible. He's like somewhere in between. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I don't know. Even I don't know, even like Silver earlier in the fight. You know, he you know in like the final fight. If you were still like a little bit earlier, maybe you would have probably would have got up a little bit more points, but but hey, it's whatever, you know. Like I still like the worst of him. He's still cool. Like, I bet he's gonna do a lot more in Ryan Rock, so so yeah, we'll we will see. Okay, yeah. Let's go on to the next character. You know what? Let's do Freya. Okay, um, Freya to me, I think when we first met her, she was like, you know, like half an hour, you know, she, you know, she seems nice, but I don't know. I think we learn, learn more about, like, Freya. Uh, she's, you know, she comes a little bit more, you know, interesting, you know, learned that she was, like, a god. We learned that she was, that she is older, you know, mother. You know, that she was, like, married to, you know, Odin. You know, she, and she was, like, the queen, you know, was the queen of the Valkyries. Mm-hmm. Uh, Freya is just very interesting character. A very tragic character, too. Like, if you, like, really think about it, like, god damn. So, yeah, I think she gives a war to me. It's not that really hard to think about. She's... I think she's up there. She's really up there for me. Just she's probably one of my favorite characters, and you know, probably like in the, like the game. You know, she's up there with like, a, like a, up there with like Aquarius and Atreus. She's just she, she's just like a very like interesting and very deep character. And we like think about like a character. It's like God damn, like like, like she's been through a lot. You know, she basically had to like sacrifice herself to. She basically had to like marry a person that she she doesn't like for to like save her like her people. Mm-hmm. It, even then, you know, she probably probably like grew to have like feelings for him, but but then like uh, she figured out that like oh, it just use her. Just used her for like her magic, you know, to try to like learn magic. Just like oh, and just like almost, just, almost like ha, huh, you, you thought I love you, I didn't. Eh? Like I did not. Eh? I just want you for your magic. Ha ha. Now you're banished. Now be gone. Eh? He just like banished her to like Midgar, where she had to stay there for. Probably like for like eternity and not allowed to like go anywhere else besides from that. It was just like very fucked up. It's just like guys, like a can you like imagine you have to like stay for like one place your whole life and you can't just go anywhere else. Even if you do, you have to like go back to that place that that like they're like you're uh, cursed to be in. Yeah, it's very messed up to like really think about. Yeah, it's something like my dad, like, you know, her relationship with, like, her son, Boulder. Mm-hmm. Uh, just, like, very, yeah, it's very sad to hear. So, yeah, I'm giving her, like, awards. She's, I think she's deserved to, like, just based on, like, her past, her personality, what she went through. You know, like, even, like, the stuff with, like, her son, you know, trying to, like, protect her son from, like, a cruel fate. Just... Uh, it's just very hard on her if you really think about it. It's just, it just boggles the mind. Just like, you know, what she had to like go through, what she, you know, what her judgment was like in trying to like protect her son from like an unbreakable, from like a uncertain death, you know, from like, from like her perspective. You know, and it's, and it's so, we separate her from that, you know, want nothing to do with her for like probably like for like a century or so, maybe like a lifetime, like who knows how long it, it took her to do it. So yeah, she gets a war. Uh Boulder, the son of Freya, uh the nephew of 
I think he's like the nephew of Thor, if I if I remember correctly, but I could be wrong. You you guys can tell me in the comments down below if I'm wrong. So yeah, Boulder to me. I think we first met Boulder, he was like at like a B. Like he really was at like a B to me. He's very like being like, you know, cosmetic person, you know, he's you know, he's very like smart with his words, you know, try to get like his victim like wild up, you know. You know, trying to like butt heads with like people, but I don't know if you really like if you like take that all away from him. He's like a very tragic character. He he's like with like his mom, like you know, he's basically like invulnerable to like anything that like can pierce him. Like nothing can like stop him. Like like knives, bullets, you know, all that can't stop him. But yeah, which seems like pretty cool. He. We actually like think about him. He's kind of like Luke Cage in like a way, but the only difference is between like Luke Cage and him, like he doesn't really feel anything. He can't really love, feel the heat, like nothing like that. Unlike Luke Cage, where he can like, he can like you know like he can like take a bullet or take like a stab wound, but he still can like like feel like the air. He can still you know, you know. Well, you know, make love to me. You, you, you get what I'm saying. You know, Bobo can't like really do that and just, I don't know. I think, like, to me, like, based off like that, I think he should be up there with his mom, but I don't know. It's just, I, I really do feel like the one thing that's home back from being like, from being like a war to me, like, to being like a top tier character, just like, I don't know, just, you know, him just trying to kill his mom. And I don't know, it, it, it's fucked up. It, 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 yeah, let's get that out of the way. It's pretty fucked up for him to like, you know, trying to kill his mom from like, you know, from, you know, from not like, let him like feel pain or anything. So, so yeah, I didn't like put Boba at like an A for that. Like, I get his mom a bitch, I really do. Hey, if I was in his position, I would probably do the same thing. But I don't know. It's still fucked up right now. That's that. Yeah, that's not okay. Like it's really not. Mm. So yeah, I don't know. Based off that, yeah, I think Bo's gonna be like a. Uh, if Bo would just like, would just learn to like move on. I don't know. He's just like, he, he's just like a hey, with fussy of like Krails, you know, back in like God War one, two, and three, where it's just like he's so. Like determined on like on like revenge, so just trying to get like get this one person to feel what he's feeling, but at the end of the day, it's not worth it. And yeah, and that was Boulder's downfall, really. Uh, if I was Boulder, and by, you know, if I could like feel for the first time, you guys remember that scene where he can like feel the air for the first time? He like they like a, he think like like uh, crows and like a trays. That was me. I was just like. I probably, I would probably would went back into that war that he was coming from and just go back to Ag, go back to Asgard and just enjoy the rest of my life. Mm. Like he could have done that, but but he started to like he says to say like, hey, I can feel again, but I still need to get my mom. Like mm. like I still need to get her. So yeah, that's what's holding back from being like a war to me to be, you know, for Bo to be up there with like his mother. <sighs> yeah, at least that's yeah. It's very sad. I want him to be like higher. I really do, but it wasn't for like his like his moments to like kill his mom. He would have been much higher. Like God, yeah, it, it hurts me not to put him up there. Which is a by itself. So yeah, let's move on to the next character, Brock. Brock to me, like at first. Like, at first, I thought it was, like, a C, you know, I couldn't, like, tell, but, like, I did, like, one off the bat, I could, I could easily, like, get his personality out of the way. He's just, you know, he's really, like, a strong man, you know, like, he, he really doesn't like a song, like, like his, he doesn't like showing off, like, his, like, emotions to, like, anybody. You know, he's, he's very, like, you know, he's trying to, like, play tough to anybody to see, like, you know, he's, like, the best, best man, you know, in, in like all the lands, like he made, you know, like near near, like you know, like Thor's hammer, you know, in like trade, in like trades, you know, 
like um his environment and that's like he's very good at what he's doing but just like you know he can be like hard headed sometimes and seem like an asshole to people but like we really look at him he's he's a really nice dude he really does care about people he really does like he really does like care about it, like his customers you know to put it that way you know you you know like you know like a when like a trade guy said, you know, he got, you know, worried, you know, you know, he, you know, and, you know, he, and he wanted to help. So I'm still with my words a little bit. I'm trying to think what I'm about to say. Yeah. I did try to like help like Krells with, you know, with like, you know, getting like the heart, getting like the heart of like Helheim. So I did brought to me, I did Brock is an A to me. I did Brock is like a really good character. I love his voice actor. He's like amazing. He did like a like a really good job. Like uh, I didn't like him, and I didn't probably go do Sentry next. It's probably like the probably like the stories like I don't know, like comic relief characters. I I really do feel like I don't know, they want like in the story, you know. You know, they want so to be like kind of like joking like the way. Uh, I think the story, you know, the story will have been. Mm, I don't know, like, uh, you kind of need that like comic kind of relief, and I think Brock does does like a really good job at like doing that. Yeah, and like the end of the day, you know, he does, you know, you know, get back with like his brother, and you know, learns that like, hey, you don't have to make weapons; you can make other things besides making weapons of mass destruction. You can make something. That's like lighthearted. That could be key to like holding like valuable things. Yeah. So yeah, I think Bark is like an A to me. Great character. I don't know. The only the only reason that he's not at like a war is because you know he's not. You know he's not like I don't know. He really doesn't like fight. You know I know he wants to fight like with Krebs. You know to get to like Helheim, but I think he's still. So like still work with them and you know and like follow along but mm, you know I think it was like Krell's more to like do that still like him so yeah yeah let's move on to the next character so yeah Sindri at first Sindri was at like a C you know he's you know he's kind of like uh I've been many people not like Sindri because like he's like very you know, he's, like, very shy, very quirky. He's, like, I don't know. Like he's, like, very, like, hygienic, you know, like, the sounds like he made, like, Ugh! like, Ugh! you know, like, the sounds that he made, you know, we, every time he, like, sees, like, blood or, like, sees something, like, disgusting. But I'm just serious to me. I think he's up there with, like, his brother to me, to be honest. I, I did like Sendry. I don't know, him being, like, very, like, cleanliness, you know. I did make sense to this character. It, he does explain well why he... You know, why does he feel that way? Because of, like, another person, like, talking him to, like, see that way. And when he saw it, he just, like, kind of, you know, kind of, like, see things in more of a, like, a clear way. So, yeah, I like Sidney for that. I don't know. He has, like, he has, like, some really good moments, like, with him with, like, the dragon or, or like, even when we first met him, was, you know, he tries to, like, steal, like, Krayos with, like, with, with, like, Frey's weapon, you know, he thought, you, you know, he, he thought, like, Krayos, you know, thought that he, like, took Frey's weapon, but, like, I don't know, by any means, you know, he, you know, yeah, basically what I'm trying to say, you know, Frey's not afraid to, like, stand up for himself, you know, when the time comes, and, yeah, he's up there with his brother. You know, the only reason he's not at, like, a war either because of, like, the same reason as, like, Brock, he really doesn't, like, fight, and for like Sindri character, I think that's more more understandable, you know, you know, if it's to like his personalities, but hey, who knows? Maybe in like in you know, in like in Rodney Rock, you know, we'll find out. And also, um, I've got to mention in the video, please no spoilers for Rodney Rock before before Wednesday, you know, when I get the game. So please no spoilers. If you do, I will you know, I would delete your comment, you know, please don't do that. I want, I really don't want to, you know, disable comments. So please, if you can hold yourselves, 
So yeah, so yeah, like Sinji is is a to let's move on to like the last two characters. Atreus. Uh, the father of Kra- you know, the son of Kratos. Strange to me, I don't know, at first he was like a C, you know, he was like very he's he was like very brass, you know, he you know, he wanted to like do stuff like his own way. He was kind of reckless in a way. And actually, like, think about it now. He, he kind of reminds me of, like, Ellie from, like, The Last of Us. You know, the first game, not the second game. You know, the second game, you know, that's something else. You know, I'm talking about, like, the first Last of Us. You know, like, the remastered version of, like, The Last of Us or whatever, you know, Last of Us, you know, part one that you want to think about. Uh, you kind of like, had, like, the same art that, like, Ellie did where it's just, like, he went from like being like a spoiled brat to being like hard head to like getting always getting into trouble to like a very calm, you know, thinking, you know, think ahead, you know, standing up for people. I, I don't know. I think what we stand up about training is like his kindness for like other people. You know, it, it's kind of like a counterbalance for like Kratos. We like Kratos. He really didn't like. We really doesn't like give, like, two cares about, like, people where, like, a trace, he really does, like, cares about people and, and try to go out of his way to, like, help people. You know, he, you know, yeah, for example, you know, you know, that, that, um, that fight with, like, the dragon, you know, if, if it weren't for, like, a trace, you know, Craig was, you know, Craig was part of the, you know, like, Sindri, you know, to get eaten, but, but, but no, like, you know, Trace, you know, convinced his father to, like, to, like, help Sindri. And, you know, he really didn't have to do that, but he did because because he's cared him, because he really does care about him. And, yeah, I hope that comments don't go anywhere in Ragnarok. Um, I don't know. I did a part of saying now he's probably going to go up to, like, a war to me. Yeah, yeah, I think he's, like, above Freya. His character also is like pretty amazing. Uh, I don't know, like the only thing that's holding back from, uh, like the one thing I really didn't like about him, you know, we learned that he was like a guy. He was kind of being like a, like a, dick to like Sindri, you know, talking about like his family problem and all that, you know, disrespecting, you know, like his mother and like a few things, you know, not taking wars, you know, went to like shoot and stuff, you know, doing like things like his own way, you know, getting. You know, his, like, you know, you know, taking, like, his father, you know, getting stuck in Helheim, you know, stuff like that. I don't know. I did, like, that, like, sound like a trace I really don't like. Hope that doesn't come back up in, like, in Ragnarok or... Uh, I would like to, like, explain why he, why he, like, did that stuff. Maybe, like, a, maybe that was, like, an alter ego of his. Who knows? Like, yeah. So, yeah, like, a trace is, like, a... It's like a war to me. Like, you know, like, despite all that, he's still a great character. Probably one of the best characters. Probably one of the best, like, kid characters in video game history. You know, you know, in my opinion, of course. So, yeah. Let's go into, like, the last character. <laughs> the main man himself. Kratos. So yeah, Kratos to me, I don't know. Kratos is like the buying me of like, of like change. Like he really is. Like I think Kratos like changed my life in like so many ways. It's just, it's just like, you know, Kratos can like Kratos like teaches that like you can't let your past hold you back from who you are, like who who you want to become. Like you know. Uh, I do from like the previous game from like God one, two, and three. You know when he, like when he like lost his family. Uh, it was very tragic. It really is like like Kratos is like like a bombing of change. Like you know, he he's basically just like bolder. You know, minus like the invulnerability. Like we, we actually know what he's got to go. At. He's he's got to go up to a war. But I just want, kind of want to explain my reasoning first. Um, so yeah, Kratos just like, 
No, he's just like special. He really is. He's like, you know, like as we like we first like see him in like the game where he's like cutting down that tree. He was just afraid of just like letting himself open to like people, to like his son, to like his, you know, he will become friends like you know like Brock and Sendry. You know, he, you know, he was like afraid to like really open up to him to like really like talk things out, like you know, you know, like know what people do. But as the like, game goes on, you know, he starts to like open up to like his son, you know, you know, teach him like his way of like thinking, and, you know, how he thinks, how he does. Yeah, yeah. Even like he explained himself, he just like, yeah, because like, you know, you do not know my ways, but but we will learn together, you know, learn, you know, to learn how to like be like a better father, a better person, you know, something to like inspire by. You know, even you know, like moments where like, where like you know, where like creators don't want to reveal like his godhood to like the creators because you know he don't want, he doesn't want to cause them pain with with you know with like being like a god. Yeah, I know he has some good good adventures of like being like a god, but it also has his like his downfall of being like a god, always being like a target to like other people and and also like that's why he doesn't want to like that's why he live in, in like the woods so he can't be found you know to be in secret but at, at the end of the story gone like I said you know he becomes more open to people he starts joking around with Tris like a little bit here and there like I don't know I think like the best scene with like like with, with like with Mir, it just like him like talk about like his past a little bit, you know, just like you know you say nothing to the boy, you know about like him being like the ghost of Sparta, you know, and yada yada yada. Well, I'm sorry, I saw I'm still on my words. I'm very tired. Ugh. So yeah, I love Kratos. He's one of my favorite characters of all time. He just, I don't know, he just. Lots of core with me to all of us. He just he doesn't bother me on change or just like, you know, just trying to be like the best father that he can be. You know, and just like let him in you know, and like letting his guard down to like to be vulnerable to like other people, to finally let go of like his blaze, you know, to let go of that burn that like the like areas that that Ari, you know, said to him like a long time ago, you know, you know, you know, finally at like the end, you could finally let go of that pain, that suffering, that anger that that hold him from like for like a very long time. He, you know, he finally broke like his curse of like of like being that, you know, that angry, that angry, that very angry. Sorry, being that very angry. Selfish, derivative, that vengeful spirit that he was, you know that's not who he is anymore. Now he's a father, a caring father that cares about his son. Will go out of his way to make sure that he will protect his son. Like, and at the end of the day, you probably get his life from him. It that mean he mean that he will love. So yeah. So yeah, guys, I did this gonna be my list for for God of War twenty eighteen. You know, this is all the like the main characters of like the game. I think I'm happy with all my decisions that I made. Yeah, I, I think I'm very happy with decisions I made. So yeah, let me know down in the comments below. Did I did I miss any characters? Let me know in the comments down below. If I did, I'll put in this description down. I'll put in in my comments if I miss. Any like any like a point characters, but I think that should be it. Uh, I know we're gonna be saying like now. Well, what about you know? Um, what about Thor and Owen? You know, we we don't know too much about them yet until Ragnarok. And please, again, no spoilers for Ragnarok until till I play the game. So please, I really don't want to sell this it with the comments. So so yeah, guys, you know this is gonna be my tier list for God of War twenty eighteen. So yeah, like let me know. What you rate these characters in the in the comments down below? 
And yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next um, tier list. And with like, tomorrow's video, we're going to be doing all enemies in the God of War 2018. So, you know, just to be clear, you know, I'm not doing like every characters in like, you know, in like the whole series. So yeah, see you guys.